Hey loves, this is your girl Fat Girl Fight Back. I wanted to get on here and do a really quick video of what my water fast consisted of. So the water fast is literally what it sounds like. It's a water fast. Um, if you see me looking down, I'm reading my notes. So, you know, um, it's no eating or drinking anything other than water. You can, you're supposed to drink two to three liters of water per day. Um, and your fast should not last any longer than 72 hours. Um, and you can do anywhere from 24 to 72 hours. It's your choice. I went seven days because I listened to my body and, um, I was able to go. Like I was busy all week last week and I wasn't tempted. Like I was, I was perfectly fine, perfectly fine with doing seven days of water fast. So the water to drink. The best water to drink on a water fast is, so if you were to do your research on a water fast, it says the best, the best water to use is distilled water. I personally use alkaline water. Distilled water is still acidic and um, it doesn't really replace any of your electrolytes that are being flushed out by the water. Now alkaline on the other hand that has um, the electrolytes and um, other stuff that's enhancing the water and it's perfectly fine. Like when I first started doing a water fast and I started started fasting, I had the worst headache until I found alkaline water. And alkaline water cut all of that out. So, um, and my pH, if anyone wants to know, in my water, in my alkaline water is 8.5 and above. So 8.5 to 10.5 is what I did my water fast on. And um, yeah. So, um, sorry. So the benefits of water fasting. I had several people tell me today it was not healthy. Several people today tell me that it wasn't healthy. So these are just a few benefits of water fasting. It aids in weight loss. You're guaranteed to lose one or two pounds of fat. Not water weight, but fat within your fast. Improve, excuse me, it improves blood sugar control it um, helps with heart health, brain function, and also prevents cancer. And um, it's actually a lady who told me about a water fast who had cancer. And she water fast with alkaline water. And the cancerous cells that they saw in her body before, they didn't see it anymore. After her fast. After she was drinking the water for a while. Um, but there are some cons. There are some cons if you decide to only do the, whatever water that you buy at the store, like Nestle, Smart Water, Core Water, Dasani. Like, none of that water is good for you. None of that water has a good pH in it. So, if you do decide to only do distilled water, which we all know distilled water is nothing but water boiled to get all of the acidic, some of the acidic stuff out of it. Um, but you have to be aware that that normal water can, if you're not replacing the electrolytes and the salts that it's flushing out of your system, you're going to be weak. You're going to have headaches. Um, and if you do too much of that without replacing the electrolytes and salt in you, then you can go into a cardiac arrest. Relax. It's not going to happen within 24 hours or 72 hours, but just be mindful of what you're doing to your body. Listen to your body. You know, if you're getting hungry after 19 hours, that's good. You try, eat something, and try to do it again, you know. Um, and I would suggest eating something salty as far as an olive, maybe even pickles. Something that's going to be really, really salty where you don't have to drink salt. And on my fast, I also decided to work out. I was on a 30-day workout challenge, and I just could not end my challenge on the fact that I started this weight loss journey. I mean, this um, water fast. So what I did is um, I worked out every day, sometimes twice a day. I got up in the morning, I worked out, and I worked out in the evening. But it was only 15 minutes in the morning, and I did no more than 30 minutes at night. And I did stuff from my home, anything on YouTube that had cardio or a little bit of weightlifting or anything like that that helped me um, you know, it helped me from being hungry, I can honestly say, or snacking at night. Um, but I know people who have, have worked out normally, like they would normally do if they were eating a whole bunch of protein, and they still lost weight. So it really depends on your body. If you're not used to fasting, start off with 24 hours and work your way up to 72 and then work your way up to days, um, like more than, more than three days.